Hello everyone, welcome once more to Mathematics Pro. So today we are going to calculate the radius of the cylinder below given the volume. So they gave us the volume and the height. We are asked to calculate the, the radius. So in doing that we need to write the formula of volume so that we'll be able to substitute all the values so that we can calculate the unknown which is the radius. So let's get started. So in order to write the formula of volume, I would not like you to memorize. What I want you to remember is that volume is equals to base area times the height. So the base area times the height. Now what is the base of this cylinder? So the base is a circle. So we are going to look uh, write the formula of area of a circle, which is pi r square times the height so this is the formula of volume next we need to make r the subject since we are going to calculate r we can substitute the values of v so we know that v is 1540 should be equals to pi pi is 22 over 7 times h h is 10 times r square we don't know it so we write r square is the unknown so we have this fraction so we can put this over one we have a fraction so we can as well multiply all the equation by by seven or we just cross multiply so we can cross multiply one times any number remains the same so one times all of this so we are going to have 22, 22 times 10 is um, 220 r square r square should be equals to we need to multiply we need to multiply 1500 times 7 1500 times 7 will give us 10,000 10,780 so we want to make r square the subject so we need to divide by the coefficient just as when you have like 3x equals to 6 if you want to calculate x you need to divide by the coefficient of x which is 3 so here we need to calculate r so we have to divide by the coefficient of r square which is 220 because here x is the same as 6 divided by 3 so here we are going to have r square will be equals to 10,780 divided by 220 so this 0 and this 0 will cancel will be left with 1,078 divided by 22 will give us r square will give us if we divide this we are going to have 49 so but this is r so if we r square if we want to calculate the radius r will be equals to the square root of 49 which is equals to 7 so this implies r is equals to 7 centimeter thanks for watching please subscribe